Get up. Mm. Oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. <laughs> Doc? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. <laughs> Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My well, family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Ja, hopp. Vad ska jag göra nu då? Jag får väl gå och hjälpa till med att bygga fortifikationer då. Uh, be sure to check in with everyone you met so far. Aha. Seems like those two are getting along. Ska jag gå och prata med henne då kanske eller vad då? Hej. Kan jag det? Jo, talk to. Talk to Katja. You have such pretty hair. It gets hey. lots of tangles. Hey there girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, um, uh, how's that? <laughs> it's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Mycket. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Eh, uh, nu valde jag fel alternativ. Jag tänkte hey. fråga hur det är i staden. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help and we just passed people over some just just uh, It's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Um, hmm. Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay. Nej, men... Ja, nu valde jag fel alternativ igen. So, uh... What do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Nu upptäckte jag att man kan välja svarsalternativ genom att scrolla på skrådjulet istället för att trycka på siffertangenterna. Så det underlättar nog lite faktiskt. 
He seems like an all right dude. Så det är det Kenny. Då får jag gå och prata med honom också. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But... We're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Uh, detta spelet är ju baserat på... Uh, seriealbumen av... Uh... Uh, vad han nu heter. Uh, ja, i alla fall. Uh, men Hörsel, det är väl han som äger en farm i tv-serien. Så det verkar även som om det är lite baserat på tv-serien också. Men främst är det väl seriealbumen som det är baserat på. Uh, Robert Kirkman, eller något sånt heter han väl, som gjorde serien. Eller... Han håller väl fortfarande på Jordan tror jag. Nobel. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katja wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See ya. Okay. See ya. So what shall I do now? I can go hit, maybe. Yeah. There they are holding on with the rocket. Yeah. Do you uh, think this thing will keep them out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. There sits the duck. On the tractor. Hello, hello, I'm driving my truck. My tractor. Uh, look at, talk to, skava yura. How you doing, duck? Good, I'm going to drive the tractor. Lift with your back, Sean. Eh, tack för tipset. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. Kan jag inte prata med? Jo, det kan jag. Sean's still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bytes to length, that sure speed things up. So, now it's time to soak a little bit, Julian. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid, a boy. Just shot him right in the face. You gotta do what you can to survive. I put a gun to that kid's head and pulled the trigger. Fuck that, man. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Sometimes. Kill or be killed. I guess. I don't think I'd sleep good after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? 
My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh, man. I hope so, too. Maybe it's not too bad there. I'll never That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Så det är väl dit jag ska här näst då. How are these things to drive? Awesome! <laughs> Pain in the ass mostly. Big, heavy as hell, and slower than uh slow than uh vad då? How you doing, Duck? Good! I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Mm, det var sagt det redan. Tack för tipset. Där är den. Hörsel. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. I ain't dumb. I caught you in that lie last night about who you were with in that car. And honestly, I don't even want to know. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Mm. I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. This farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yep. I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Uh oh. The let him go. go. I'll get my gun. Ah! 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 Uh, nej. Så kan man rädda han också, tror jag. Kan han inte backa trappen, kanske? Eh, uh, oh, aj då. Jag räddade pojken, men uh, uh, han blev ju zombimat. Jag vet inte om jag gjorde rätt eller fel val. Jag är 
Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry! And you! You didn't even try to help. I was worried about the boy. Look at him. But you weren't worried about that. Hmm. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Got that ride to making if you want it. 